All right, this video is for the 2007 Dodge Ram. If you're trying to replace your starter and you don't know how, this is the video for you. Um, I haven't really seen many videos on YouTube really explaining how to do this, so yeah. First thing you're gonna need to do is remove the battery or the positive terminal of the battery. Just do that. And this is the part that was the most difficult. I'm right here, this is the driver's side tire. I'm gonna come behind it. I'm just gonna flip around and go right underneath. The starter is right there. It's like right now, this is the driver's side tire, right here, and then it's right there. You have two bolts and two wires you need to remove. The first bolt is, the first bolt is right here. Let it focus, hold on. This is the first bolt right here. This one was pretty hard to get off because it's really hard to get like leverage on it so you need like an extender I used an extender to come out to like right here and then use this little area right here to really get it out so that's what you need to do and then the second bolt is a little bit further down right underneath this little bend right here it's inside of there inside of this little bend right there and again the driver's side tire is right there I'm laying right next to the driver's side tire and this is right by my head um, before you start doing that though you need to pull off this wire right here this is simple you just press that button right there and pull off and then once you have the com the starter completely out, there's gonna be a, a screw that you have to take off. It's right there, back there, right, right back there. Um, you have to take that screw off to take the other wire off. And then it slides right out. The starter just slides right out. And then you just put the new one in, use the same bolts, and you're good to go. This is for the 2007 Dodge Ram. And then you come back up here, reconnect your battery, and then it's good to go. The problem I was having with my starter was, well, it was just old, really. And it, it wasn't starting good. Like, the first few cranks seemed to take out a lot of energy, or a lot of power, from my truck. I went to uh, AutoZone and they tested it and they said that my starter was pulling too much power and then a few weeks later my truck just wouldn't start and that was the problem. I smelled the solenoid so I knew that my starter burnt out and I needed to get a new one. So I hope this video can help someone. Thank you for watching my video.